Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with a vlog because I had a rough night last night. Um, a lot of news came at me a lot of fast, and I just didn't have the energy to do any recordings, any editing, anything. It was not great news. We might have a problem with our newest hire at work. And one of my musical and otherwise creative inspirations might have broken the cardinal rule as a creative which is you don't fuck your fans I I can't talk a lot about the one at work because that's still under investigation, but everything seems to be pointing towards him about it. And it's really not good. It's not a good look. So... It's unfortunate for him. I'll tell you that. As for the creative, I'm sure a lot of you are aware of who I'm talking about. As this is being recorded on Monday, March fuck, 22nd. Yeah. It's early morning before I go to work, as you can tell by my hair. Not naming names, obviously, but... <sighs> this has compounded onto a month where I have been kind of struggling weirdly enough not with uh emotional turmoil just physical i've been i've been blaming the new bed for most of it uh because i just recently got a new bed and fuck is it comfortable but i have been lazing about Far more than I ever have. Uh, and I am... Not getting as much done as I would have hoped. That's kind of the reason why I didn't end up... Recording more before this whole news came down uh, I was intending on doing it last night until all of it hit the fan it's not fun getting bad news and then worse news all in a row but uh that's what happened yesterday and when you're already struggling to find the energy to make things, it will just wipe you out entirely. But at least it's raining outside, as you might be able to tell from the sounds outside. Maybe you can't. Maybe it's just outside the microphone's range. But uh, at least the weather sounds like how I feel. I 
I don't want to touch on any of the other allegations from what's going on with this creator because it doesn't sound it doesn't sound like what people are accusing him of is actually what's going on at least on one of them one of the things involved um But, there is a certain relationship that you should have with your fans that should not become sexual at any point. It becomes a problem. It is a power imbalance that no one should become anywhere close to because it is just not worth it everything else could be just wild misinterpretation but the fact is from the sound of it he did actually engage in some sort of sexual relationship and that is Something you shouldn't be doing with fans. I'm going to come out and say that right now. You should never be in that sort of relationship with people who are fans of your work. That is to say, don't keep them at an arm's length, but... Don't let it get to that point. You can be friends with them, but after a certain line, there's no going back, and that is not a good place to go. Personally, I, if I'm looking for any partner at all in the future... I would rather someone who doesn't know any of my creative work because, quite frankly, that is a very risky proposition. Regardless of your size of a creator or, you know, how popular you are, there is a power imbalance there and it is not worth taking advantage of at all. It's a shame too because I like uh, I like all his stuff. I'm a big fan of all the stuff. And this hit like a fucking sack of bricks underneath a piano that fell from an already falling plane. Something out of a fucking Looney Tunes cartoon. That's what it felt like. <sighs> anyway. Neither here nor there. That's the main reason I didn't get anything done. And I do apologize that I couldn't make it. But I also felt I needed to talk about the situation as it was. Especially due to the fact that they were a huge inspiration musically and otherwise for myself. Uh, I wouldn't say the sole inspiration, uh, but uh, pretty high up there. It's a God's damn shame. Some people just cannot seem to... Can't seem to let the power imbalance not be exploited. 
It'll happen to the best of us. And the worst of us. Boy. Boy, have there been a lot of the worst of us in that sort of news cycle. Anyway. I'm going to end this vlog before I get more upset. And as you can tell, I probably need to freshen up before work. I'm just happy this is my Friday. That way I can just... Ignore the world for a little bit. Maybe hopefully I can get my uh, mojo going again on creating. Because that would be fucking great. Because right now it is in the shitter. That is where it is. That motivation. Anyway. <sighs> Fuck. Well, anyway, man, I'm a mess. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together and whatever else happens to be in the news cycle about creators. Because it seems to be I have to talk about almost every other one at this point. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only stray cat playing games, vlogging, being upset that one of my inspirations cannot seem to respect the power equation between a fan and creator as much as he should. Unfortunately, it has become too common, but fuck, I was not happy it was him. And uh, hopefully I bounce back from this because I want to keep creating. Despite one of the main inspirations for it uh, being a problem. Here's hoping I can find it again for you.